So, Amari Hardwick is a man who is very articulate with the way he answers questions, with deep thoughts and analysis, and it's why he made the role of James St. Patrick so great. Because the man Amari, he runs deep and breaks down different layers, not just with the role of Ghost, but himself as a person. And when he talks, you listen, because he really is a master poet, and he delivered yet another masterclass on the Pivot podcast, which I will link down below in the description and comment section for those who want a real insight into the man behind Ghost and James St. Patrick. But for the purpose of this video, we're just going to focus on what Amari's alternate ending to power would have been, and what could have been for the power universe if this happened. Now, many know Power was centered around Ghost trying to leave his life as a drug dealer and live his life as James St. Patrick, but leaving the game is never as easy as entering, because once you're in, you're stuck, and there are only two possible outcomes, either death or jail, and in Ghost's case, it was death. So, the original ending we got with Power was to re-killing his own father, Ghost, because power really is a vicious cycle where actions have consequences. Now unfortunately Tommy arrived to the scene too late and he wasn't able to save his brother. But how would Omari Hardwick have played things out if he was the one writing the script? Now, the tale of Romeo and Juliet is based on an old age vendetta between two very powerful families which erupts into bloodshed. A young love struck Romeo falls for Juliet and they both eventually die for each other. And Omari Hardwick likened his ending not exactly to Romeo and Juliet, but to Romeo and Romeo, where Tommy was trapped at the end of power with no way out. And as we know the man of ghosts, he always finds a way, whether it was with Felipe Lobos, Milan or Jason Michic, he was a man who was only three moves ahead of his enemies and he always seemed to find a way, just like Tariq St. Patrick is now finding out with the moves that Ghost is making beyond his grave. But his ending was, there was no way he could save Tommy, whether he looked left, right, up or down, until he realised it would have to be a life for a life. He had to give his life to protect and save Tommy, which really would have been a beautiful and a poetic end to James St. Patrick, him going out in a blaze of glory to protect Tommy. And this could have changed the course of the entire power universe with Tariq St. Patrick and Tommy, and who knows what could have been. So I'm gonna let your imaginations run wild in the comment section. So drop all your thoughts down below on Amari Hardwick's alternate ending to power. And if you could rewind time, what would you have done? Drop all your thoughts down below in the comment section. And of course, if you're new to the channel and you haven't done so already, then remember to smash the subscribe button if you want to see everything power and power universe related. But as always, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time.